Um, that being said, it does have a couple of things we need to be cautious of. First and foremost, uh, for those of you that maybe this is your first time running hard mode, the idea between hard mode is that... Pardon me, I've just got... Uh, quick question. Uh, Cope, I do have a mailbox for you. Um, either way, what I was saying. Um, so hard mode is pretty much we are battling both bosses at the same time. Um, that being said, we will be kind of shuffling around the groups when that happens in order to maximize our um, uh, people not getting hit with the curse of nightmares. So, um, do -do -do -do. sorry, what the people wish for me all of a sudden. All right, that should be settled. Okay. So, either way. Oh, go ahead, I'm sorry. Can someone resalve me to see if my add-on's working? What? Hang on. And again, please. Damn it. All right. Before I get distracted a second time or a third time or how many times it will be. Um, so yes, we'll be doing both classes today. I will try to arrange the groups as accordingly. We'll kind of figure out that once we get there. Um, in order to get there, however, we need to clear out all of the mobs. Um, mob priority going forward is normally um, the small mobs first, so the dreamers. And then it'll go the um, wormkin, suppressors, worms, um, scalebane, and dragonkin. Uh, myself or Raj will call out accordingly if we do want to switch that up. Um, Aaron, if you really want to, or excuse me, Raj, or Aaron, if you want to just say something so people know your voice. Hello. My name's Jeff. Um, yeah, so Tinks, if you see the markers above your heads, as we did last week, you're going to be responsible for marking your own targets. Once we have enough marks on all the enemies, then we'll pull the packs. Just remember which mark you have above your head. That will be yours today. And yours alone. That being said, is there anything else we need to go over, or can we start pulling? Um, the only other thing I think is that I do have an individual who is going to be skinning for me today, so I ask anyone who can skin to please not. Um, they are going to be trading me all of the skins at the end of the run today. Um, the SR sheet will be open until, uh, this mob that we're going to be versing is down. After which, it will be locked, and it will be stayed locked. There will be no exceptions, unless we've decided that for some unknown reason we cannot do hard mode today. So, that being said, you have now until all of those dreamers go down to change it. And I think that's about it. Oh, no, need someone else. Need to summon someone else. Only. Oh. Yes. No, no. Good point. I'll come out there with you. Lonnie. Um, it's gonna be two people we need to invite. The boss is a. Uh... Who's this loser? This Drew that just joined. You know, just some chump. Found him in Stormwind. It says he's the guild master or something. I don't know. They're probably a weak guild. <laughs> All 
All right. So that being said, we are a full party today, ladies and gents. We are kicking ass and taking names. Yes, I yep. will be explaining all of the tactics beforehand. All right, looks like all summons are done. Tinks, whenever you're ready, let's go ahead and start clearing these first packs. Give them plenty of time to pick up the dreamers. Shamans, put down your tremor totems. And I think I just DC'd. Melee DPS, if you see a dreamer kind of running, try to pick it up and bring it back to the tanks. Beautiful job, everyone. Beautiful job. Let's cross the river and take care of this next pack. It's two dragonkins. They both Here do spell reflexive so casters. Beware. Yep. Can I get two tanks to mark their targets? Perfect. All right, Whenever we actually have our first uh, trash drop of the evening, which is actually S art. So uh, Copeland, congratulations. Gross, man. Huge. Yeah, it's a really nice watch rank it. He just wants to lash a farm. <laughs> hey, who <laughs> doesn't want to lash a farm? Okay, tanks, whatever you're ready, let's engage. If you get aggro on a dreamer, please dream. Bring it back. We have lots of shamans today. Let's make sure to keep our tremor totems down. Alright, casters, when you see the dragonkin shimmer, that is when they are reflecting. So please be cautious. I think Popen's got pretty much all the trinkets now. <laughs> the he one. might. He just might. Cool. Let's pull skull back. I do have a collection, yeah. I think you completed the, the black one last set as well. The life giving gem, DFT, and uh, stylings. <laughs> Alright. I turn around for one second and you guys pull the whole pack. Alright, ladies and gents, once Think the dreamers the are down. Out of group. <laughs> Once the dreamers are down, the focus is going to be on the wormkin that is triangle. And then casters, you're going to focus on skull. And melee, you're going to focus on circle. heels for the tanks who are doing the wormkins please that stacking definitely hurts all right Whoa. nicely done nicely Second done mana. All right, for this worm pull, ladies and gents, we do have to be cautious of this poison volley, so all of our ranged units, make sure you are staying at maximum range. Shamans, make sure we have our poison cleansing totems down. Let's take care Fox, of the scale being next. Isn't here. We're waiting for the worm king to come back. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. For the scale bane, everyone make sure that you're staying melee, you're staying at maximum range, sitting on his tail. His front end does cleave, and it hurts. Okay. 
Cool. Worm's coming back. Let's get it next. Nicely done, ladies and gents. Nicely done. Our nest pack is across the water. That pack of dreamers along with the wormkin. I need a tank for the wormkin. Please mark it. Awesome. When you guys are ready, let's go. Make sure to have tremors down. Beautiful job, everyone. Beautiful job. Big heels on. Thorn Maul, since he had to tank the Dreamer, excuse me, the Wormkin. Aaron, we've got sights on uh, the first boss. Yes, we're going to be maneuvering around him the whole time. Beautiful. This next pack's a little bit dangerous. I want tanks to do bull pulls, fairy fire. Once marks are all out, just make sure the scale beam is away, the rest can be stacked up. I'm missing one mark on the suppressor in the back. First box is coming our way, so we want to make sure that we tuck this pack real close to the wall. Perfect. All right, we're ready to go. Tanks on the count of three. One, two, three. Everything should be stacked up. If anything's loose, Worm bring it back. Loose. All right, once the Wormkin and the Suppressor are down, Casters, you're going to focus on the Scalebane. Melee, you're going to focus on Circle. Big heals on Thorn Maul. Those of us who can interrupt, if you see the Suppressor doing a draining mana or draining health, please do so. Or excuse me, isn't please interrupt. Beautiful job, everyone. Beautiful job. Yeah, we've got some absolute powerhouses here today. I mean, that's the thing, right? It doesn't scale up the health, so having more people just means shit dies faster. This is true. We're the little bit of nutcases that like to do this at, with 20 people, so. <laughs> but having, like, a damn near 40-man raid. That's what makes it, it fun when you do cool. it with a couple people. Cool. I just need a tank to mark up Worm. The big boy. Awesome. He's got a moon. We're good to go. Healers are drinking. Let's go. Tremor totems for the whelps. When the dreamers are down, ladies and gentlemen, Cryo is definitely going to be the worm kin. Once the worm kins are down, then we'll focus on the worm. Heavy heals still on our tanks that are holding on the worm kins.
Alright, casters and healers, you want to stay back to avoid the poison volley on the worm. That would be good. Oh, thank you very much for letting me know something dropped. whip on the dragon thing. We do. We've got multiple drops today. It's like slowly making up for the past few weeks where we haven't had anything. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gents, our first drop of the or excuse me, of this pack is the Emerald Rod. It is not SR'd, so it's going to be main spec off spec. So do you have any casters or even potential healers that may be interested in the rod? That's all right, Beef Lover. I got you. Last call for rolls. We want to get this well pack across the water. Yeah. Let's go ahead and pull them over here while we're dealing with loot. It's a small pack, only pops. All right, time for the lash. There's whip. Anybody who's interested? Last call for rolls. Do you have that, Toby? It's a nice uh, fright trinket. Oh, nice. Call. Let's let's head right, over to the like middle. To be clever. Congratulations. I want to take care of this pack over here in the middle, and then we'll get the one on the left and then the right. Did we take down the... down the patrol? Ah. He's coming Let's right for us. Come over to the left a little bit over by Star. We should be safe here to not pull the boss. You want and while he's over there, let's just go and get left. the pack at the left. Yeah, let's the left pack. I've been trying to memorize his movement pattern today. He moves in right, a triangle. Let's pull. Let's go. Moon is loose. I'm asleep. Okay. After circle's dead, let's get s moon. Nicely done, everyone. Let's head over to Skull and drink up. Once the boss passes over this pack again, we'll uh, we'll pull the suppressor pack. Actually, we could probably do it now, but people are still drinking. I'd like to let him pass. Back up, back up, back up. Let's give Recall him totems. plenty of room. He's got a weird pat. He doesn't start it's like, like a triangle. All the same line. We should uh, we should hit the pack on the right side right now. Yeah. Yeah, the far right. 
Okay, but can I get everyone away from his... Patrol? Like, let's come over here. Where Skull's at? Against we'll the wall. Into the clearing, yeah. Once all of the mob packs are down, there is a pocket in the wall on, like, the upper left side of the dungeon. We're gonna convene there. That's a safe spot away from the, um, the patrol line, and we will organize the groups accordingly. Okay, two scale beans. The other two, everything's marked up. Tanks, whenever you're ready. Let's do a bow pull here on three. No, never mind, we're going. One streamers are down. Focusing on the wormkin. Tremors down. No one's sleeping on the clock loose. today. Guys, bring them back to the pack. Get for it. Bring us on ice in there. Our tanks are pretty beefy. I guess we're going to do a bow pull. It's nice to be in Nax gear, ain't that right, Jace? I don't know what you mean. I haven't got kiss of the spider yet. <laughs> That's the only thing I actually care about from Nax, I think, at this point, though. Just rub it in, boss. Just rub it in. <laughs> I'm not going to have the other gear, but, like, that's the biggest improvement yeah, I would ever get. Yeah. Sounds like a problem I wish I had. You don't have the legs from the horseman? <laughs> no, but I can live without those. Getting kissed as a spider will be the biggest increase I'll ever get to my crap per second. Well, yeah, because of the, what, 20% increase. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's quickly drink once this thing is dead. We're gonna Everything stay here, else. and we'll pull that pack all the way back. Be careful, because Aranius is coming. I'm just gonna mark... yep. I think Tinks can see from here, but there's another dragon can. I marked it with Skull. Can someone change the mark to whatever they're doing? Cool. I'm gonna pull them back now, so we don't have to wait for the dragon to pass over. I'm bringing them back to you guys. Alright, ladies and gents, once the Dreamers are down, Melee, you're gonna focus on the Suppressor. Or excuse me, casters, you're going to focus on the suppressor. Her, her. Aaron, he's getting kind of close. Yeah, keep coming backwards, I think. Pull them all over the wall. Dismiss totems and bring it. Air gas. I don't know. I don't know. We're fine, he'll turn around. Okay. This is a safe spot. I don't think this is safe. What uh, the fuck? Alright. Fuck. Fuckity fuck fuck fuck. Kill the pack and then I guess we'll wipe and get us. Yes. We're gonna wipe after we kill the pack, ladies and gents. We have the power to do uh finish off the suppressor. Hard mode. We're all going to be running in. There's no point in anybody onking or anything. So just take it, don't do damage. Just make sure that all the little guys are dead first. Yeah, it looks like everyone's dead. Just don't run in until everyone's dead. I've only done this a few times in hard mode, and that was one of the spots the raids stood at. No, we're not. They had to really hug the wall. Or anything. Just release and run back. The graveyard's like right there. Yep, you're just gonna, when you pop in the graveyard, you're literally just gonna jump off the cliff. Well, full damage. There's two still alive. In? There's two still alive. If you are alive, who is alive? We got, it's two rogues. So the fight has been reset. So just rogues who are still alive, just stay in the corner that you're hidden. Alright, who wants to be the taint for Arrhenius? 
Is that, that was our Lava. last tap, right? Sorry, I heard multiple people talking. What'd you say, Jace? I can do whatever. Okay. I'll put I would like five two tanks. Boilers. I would like two tanks for Arrhenius, and then the rest of us will be focused on the last boss. Um, I would like to split our druid tanks, so one going to the last boss, one going to... Uh... Yeah, actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably have Jace in Mirathrin. Those will be my tanks. And then I'm going to assign... I need to look at the healers first. Everyone else, do not pull the boss, but head over to the little crevice behind where Solnius is. Yes, we're gonna- we're gonna group rebuff before we split. Get the loot and also this age epic strong. Yes, I do. Um, Aaron, I would like to have him pulled on the other side of the little lake. Just so that we are aware of that. Alright, so ladies and gents, for the hard mode boss fight, the idea is we're going to have a couple of trusted healers with our two tanks, and the tanks are going to trade off for the first boss, excuse me. The tanks are going to trade off threat as uh, they take hits and everything else. Ooh, we do actually have an epic drop real quick. It is not SR'd, so if we have any of our... Actually, any of our shamans interested, this is a shaman prio roll. Ooh, Terra, nice roll. That's Terra? Yeah, that's, that's perfect for you. Hmm. That's our best in slot for elemental. Huge. So our tanks, who are going to be versing, you're going to be... I'm going to have you actually set up in two groups, two different groups, so that you won't get hit with the Curse of Nightmares. Um, for the healers and the two tanks that are going over there, I'm going to try to have the group set up as easy as I can, um, given our max capacity. Uh, so that we don't have any healers or casters accidentally getting Curse of Nightmares. Healers, if you are going to be with JCE or Mithrin, you need to make sure that you are at maximum range so you do not get that Curse of Nightmares or that Silence. So let me see. Aaron, would you like to go with the... Um, the dragon deploy group? I think so. Um, okay. Putting all healers in group 8 on the Arrhenius group. That's with Jace and Mithrin. I kind of would like the tanks to be in two separate groups. So, just so that if one of them gets hit with that Curse of Nightmares... Yeah, I'm just organizing it so that they know where they need to go. I'm going to move the healers in a sec. So if you're a healer in group 8, come over here to this peek on the map. Yes, yeah, we need to group up for buffs first. I thought you guys already buffed up. Yo, Everybody, um... we're going to stick ourselves back in this little pocket. Um, we're going to buff up. I'll do a ready check beforehand. He's probably still skidding for me. He's stuck behind the tree. You can get through it. Are you done buffing? All right, really quickly, I'm going to do a ready check. If you feel like you are missing something, please select no and put it in the chat. Yo, Aaron, you want me to show you real quick? 
Yeah, please. And Zach, come over here too. I think you're going to be our Arrhenius puller today. You'll still be on the main Amazing. boss, but it's just, uh... Sorry, we need to get Bertle's services for this pull. So, we would do it, like, over here. Or, like, the boss would be, like, somewhere here. And then the healers would be, like, you know... By the route. To where, like, where the tank would be here. Where I'm standing now. Right? The boss would be, like, here. And then healers would be like here, where they could still heal the tank, but are LOSing. Yeah, that's about what I saw on the other side, too. In that case, uh, let's just do it on the other side of the lake where Heine said. So, uh, Zat Skype, Dial, Flurry, Macarius, watch the boss, but come over here to the south side. Flurry, are you in Discord? Oh, someone's about to lose their SR. No, he's coming. And then Jason, uh, you said you wanted Mithrin and Jace both on this boss? Yes. Yeah, they need to essentially keep aggro, and I trust their um, their armor. Because right, that's well, the big thing with this, is that you're going to get hit hard. But I would like, um, I'd like the tank separated. Okay. Coincidence, can you come over and be in this group as well? Or do you prefer being the main group because you're a priest? Do you want cool. us to go over that uh, right our fifth healer. So if I can make a suggestion, it's better to have the single target healers over with the, uh, the second boss. And also, um, it, I would also put them in the same group. It makes it a little easier when one of them gets slept to heal them. Okay, so I'm going to move. Put them all in the same group or different group? You, we would want to put them in different groups. You want Marcus all the healers here. in this, that same group together. The like Arrhenius group healers. I mean, as long as they stay at maximum range, they're not going to get the silence, but. So I see your point. Well, they shouldn't get the silence because we're line of sight in the boss. Right. All right, so Zat, basically, Chase and Mithra, I need you guys over here too. You're part of this group on the south side. Hydra, I don't have runes. Can you put them down to just kind of delegate where people are going to stand? All right. Uh. Yeah, coincidence, you can pop one if you'd like to. Everyone else, if you'd like to pop a nature protection potion, um, once we get everyone else situated for the sec for the first boss, I'll give out kind of the instructions for the second boss. I do have some on me. I'm selling them at 50 cents a potion, or excuse me, 50 silver a potion. Difference. There's the I'll difference. give you 50 copper. <laughs> that's kind of roughly, but like you'll have to adjust. Shit, I don't have any fucking bag space. Yeah, so then basically the boss is just going to be sitting here by these uh, so flowers. just trade. And the tank's going to stand so that they can the healers can see them, the but line aside the boss. Does it make sense for everyone? Just give me a plus in chat and say we're here if you're good. The biggest thing for the Arrhenius healers is to, preferably if they can, call out on Discord, but um, when one of you guys gets slept, uh, make sure that other people, the other healers, are healing in. 
Because honestly, also don't. Tank isn't going to be taking like a ton of damage. Just quickly yeah. type in chat Z Z Z Z Z. Why? If you're sleeping. Oh, gotcha. Cool. Big thing too so is like, during ad phase, don't let any whelps come over to the tank group and sleep us all. Otherwise, we'll wipe. So tanks be on the ball with picking up whelps over there. That's why I kind of want most of the tanks over in the main group and just one over here. Does not have a stacking debuff though? All right, everybody, let's um. That's the main boss. Aaron, you guys think you're going to be okay? Because I'd like to yeah, really quickly just... just had one tank over here with Arrhenius, but, I mean, however you guys want to do it. Let's just say Jace is over here just in case something goes wrong. And if Mithrin or... If Jace or Mithrin see any whelps come to us, then they'll pick them up and drag them back over to the main boss. That works. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's do a ready check. All right. Boy, am I pulling again? You're going to pull once uh, Aaron tells you to. You're gonna be pulling yeah, the, the first boss. Have you gotcha. explained the um, actual Sonius fight to people? I'm about to. I just wanted no. to make sure that we had the first boss squared away. If I'm the boss, it's like right when he's patrolling back, and right about here is when you where you want to pull him. Okay. All right. For the um, the main boss, Thorn, I'm gonna have you as. Um, a main tank, Copeland and Human Shield, you're going to be doing off tanking and the ad pickups. Um, Thorn, if you need to switch out because of um, stacks, just let them know. Everyone else, this boss has three phases. The first phase lasts till he's at 90%. This is a low and slow portion of the fight. We want to make sure that our tanks are number one and two on the threat meters. At 90% health, he will switch to his dragon form, and it will cause a threat drop. It'll drop to the second person. So we want to make sure that um, our tanks have threat. At 60% health, he will go to sleep. He'll summon two portals, um, where big adds and small adds will spawn. Unlike when we were doing the mob fights, we want to make sure that the big adds go down first. They will continue to spawn more little adds. So everyone, prio, big ads, then small ads, all melee and range GPS. The ads need to go down before we refocus back on the boss. The boss will be asleep for probably only about 15 to 20 seconds. After that, he will pop back up. He'll still be targeted on the individual that was on number one on the threat meter. So I'm hoping that is going to stay Thornmall. But the other thing we need to be cautious of is that if you can decurse, ladies and gentlemen, I ask you do not. Because during this boss fight, if you decurse any of the curses that get applied, he will reapply a stronger curse. That also includes any of the um, poisons that anyone might acquire. He the only one you want to decurse is the Sanctum Mind Decay, though. Yeah, really? I think isn't that the mana, the mana one yeah. where it burns mana? Yeah. Okay, that's a new tactic I didn't think about. Well, we're explaining no. this real quick. Everyone come back over. We're do a quick rebuff on paladin buffs, and then we'll pull. Real quick, Ooh, just gotcha, to get gotcha. a long explanation. Yeah, ideally, you'd want to do the explanation first, then call for buffs, because I think we, we call for buffs first, then we did a long explanation, now, like, half the Yeah, I didn't think again. it was going to last that long. <laughs> But, um, but yeah, so either way, once the boss comes back up, ladies and gents, adds first, then we're going to refocus on the boss. Big heals on our tank that is holding the boss. That corrosive acid does massive damage. Um, so Thorn, if you need to switch out, say it in the chat, and we'll facilitate it. Okay. Um, Alright. All right. So, we're yeah. group back in position. I think we're all yeah, buffed up and ready to go. It. Remember, first uh, ten percent. We're going to be um, doing low and slow damage, making sure that our tanks are number one and two. Everyone who is not part of the solo dragon over there, you're gonna come over here, where X is bouncing. 
Aaron, let me know when you guys are in position. I'll start our boss fight over here. Main tanking, that's going to be Thorn. Uh, Thorbald, do you have Gift of Arthur's? Oh, yeah, I do. Oh, oh sweet. Cool. All right. <laughs> do not start the RP until we're giving you the go-ahead in the dragon group. Okay. Is that you ready? Go ahead and pull. Just remember, no cleansing, except for Sanctum Mind Decay. Also, Pulling now. with your... Uh, all right, we're starting our boss fight. Early and often. Tanks, pick it up. Healers, line aside it. Thorn. Feign death too soon. Why did you guys start the RP? We didn't give you the go-ahead. You kind of have to start the fight or else it doesn't trigger correctly. I'm dead. Like. Oh, dear. I didn't get a chance to uh, feign death before you ran away. Alright, everyone, again, low and slow. We want to make sure that our tanks are one and two. Right now, we've got Copeland and Polly. Alright, looks like it's Copeland yeah, and Thorn. I'm trying Beautiful. to stay just behind him because it's like 90, I think it switches or something, right? Yes. Yeah, at 90, he'll switch to his bigger form. Alright, everyone, just like any dragon, you want to stay at the back end, not the front end. DPS, be cautious for your healers. If you need to step out of the fight in order to patch a band-aid, take a health Glory portion, down. do what you gotta do. What did you say, Hydra? Glory's down, he got slept. Okay. Let me know if you need another healer, and I'll send one over. But we're doing some serious quick damage on this guy. Yeah, we're all dying over here. The healers are not line of sighting. Alright, can I get Scratchy to go over there? Boss is not... In a position, he's literally on top of the branch. Oh fuck. Alright, he's going to I sleep. Sleeping. Yeah, the whole group over there is down. Yep, pretty much. He's coming like a freight train. Copeland, is there any chance that I can get you to go over there? And then, um, could I get one of our warriors to pick up? He got full X off of me and I'll go. Well, I'm trying. Alright, this may be. This is a wipe. Yeah, I don't think anybody was left. Yeah. All right, everyone, we're just going to wipe. We're going to let everything reset, and then we're going to run back in. Be gone. The ads will disappear after a while, as they're doing. We're going to reconvene back in that corner, rebuff, reevaluate the situation, and um, go from there. So we are going to be running in. Just watch the big dragon. Aaron, could you tell me what we'll have to, uh, we'll need for Arrhenius? Question. For Arrhenius, right, he should patrol up and down the river. Mm -hmm. Right now, to me, it looked like the angle he got pulled out was awful, and it made it so there was too big of a delay between him getting to his position and being able to be held there with aggro versus, like, you know, the travel time. So the travel time needs to be shortened, so is there a way we can pull him from the river straight in line behind the tree branch would make like a five second of travel time compared to about 20. Because the be line of sight to... issue was also caused by the pole going a bit haphazardly. Right. Right, right, right. 
I won't lie, really? Hydra Spot is fine. Um, it's kind of like there's a spot in Aranus's path over here where there's also a tree branch you could use the line of sight, which I prefer. I've seen this over in the ponds pugs. They just do it there because it's like literally the middle of his troll both ways. I didn't think Hydro's positioning was bad per se. I just think where we actually attacked him from to pull him there was the problem. I also think there's no point in having two tanks, right? Like there's no threat drop. There is, yeah, so we only have one tank. Um, also, like, right where Arrhenius is now, now is when you'd want to start the RP. And then Arrhenius would start coming towards us. You guys could intercept it right there. Also, does, are you guys opposed to me, like, swapping back to Resto and maybe, like, either healing Arrhenius' side or this side? Um... That actually would be probably pretty the good. <laughs> Alright, I do have a mailbox over by X. Plus a bank, or excuse me, uh, an alliance auction house. Alright, so, um, that being said, Hydro, if you do want to switch, and then I'm going to have you set up with the Arrhenius group. That being said, um... I'm sorry, you said you wanted me in the Arrhenius one? Yes. Okay. I think Mithrin was doing a pretty good job of taking it. Jason, would you find going to the main group? I don't particularly carry the way. Okay. I'm and sure you'll be I'm our minute man. I'm going to bring you back to... Um... I'm going to bring you back to the first group, then. Alrighty, so, that being said, we're going to change our tactic in that regard. Um, Aaron, you're going to still stay over there until they pull and hold. I think you're right. I think I started the false fight way too early. That was definitely my bad. Um, I will wait for you to give me the heads up. I think I panicked a little bit on starting the boss fight. Do you have to activate it before combat? I think Hydro's suggestion is that you start the Solnius boss fight and that leads into the um, Arrhenius running towards us so that a tank can pick it up and intercept it. So that they both work in conjunction with each other. You start Solnius and you have to engage Arrhenius because he starts aggroing anyway. Right. So they do have happen at the same time. Mm -hmm. uh, coincidence, you're still... Um... Did somebody bot start a boss the fight? Mm. There's a boss here. Aggro. But Solnius is... How? What just it went on happened? Boom, doink. Hunter Bull? Is your pet out of... No, pet. there was some... Um... Okay, we're gonna die again. <laughs> I'd like Can we to just group up and start man. instead? Then... Yeah. Hydro went for a walk. I don't know if he talked to the boss or something. No, he's not, the boss isn't pulled. And I guess the boss just came over the branch and saw us chilling. It aggroed something behind a tree. I'm not sure what. Oh, there goes my soul stone. Huh. Uh, ladies, so. Sorry about that, ladies and gents. Yes, coincidence, I think that's a good idea. We're gonna convene at the entrance, buff up. Well, go over strategy and then buff up. Yeah, because otherwise we're just gonna be wasting buffs and winning this position to pull back some. I do have an alliance spot. I'm gonna put that down first before switching to uh, the auction house. However, I did burn my mailbox. Oh, I have an that alliance hurt. spot here. I can drop a mailbox too if you want. Thorn, the hero of the hour. Let me know when you want the mailbox. 
Wait till people get in. Alrighty, so, um... <laughs> Who was speaking before we accidentally pulled? Was, was it Aaron? Was it Jordan? I don't, I don't remember who was- we were talking about strategy. I don't remember what I was saying. Okay, okay so to conclude where we were in that conversation, we were discussing about starting them together. And what Hydra is suggesting is talking to Solnius, falls in Arrhenius, and the tanks intercept it and keep it in the spot where he suggested. Which okay. makes a bit of sense, because that's how you trigger hard mode by talking to Solnius and Arrhenius getting aggroed, as would that pop up we just saw. I'm in agreement with that statement. Alrighty. Actually, the only thing that went wrong last time was just that uh, it all went wrong and we had a few issues from there, and that left the line of sight issues to the healers, causing them to die in the Arrhenius group. So gotcha. like, that's just the improvement for this go around. There's not much more to discuss in my mind. Alright. Well then, if the Arrhenius group knows what they're going to be doing, and everyone else knows what we're going to be doing, then once we are buffed up, um, I'm going to... Just need to know uh, where we're tanking Arrhenius. It's the same spot or a different spot? Same spot. Okay. I dropped a mailbox on Star for you real quick. Alright, if anyone needs a mailbox, there's still some auction house to put them down. For the Arrhenius group, you can dispel poison, right? Yes. Or, actually, I think it's physical poison, so you might not be able to. Alright, we have two people who are AFK. Arya and Flurry. If you wanna... Make some in beautiful. Yeah, I think um, there's only, there's only two priests buffing high knees, so they need like a lot of time to buff. That's yeah. No, that's fine. I know that. Right, yeah, it's just... That's why I was gonna say let's wait till to move, but we all just kind of moved. Yeah, a lot of people just moved already. Yeah. We're just working out the kinks for the specific pulls, ladies and gentlemen. This is the first time with this group that we'll be running hard mode, so. <laughs> Very funny coincidence. <laughs> Alright, it doesn't look like we're going to make it this time around, so everybody should go back in that cubby and stack, like, all the way in the back so we don't pull them again. And then on the next go around... We'll all get in position, and then we can start the event and pull on. Okay. It's just like in BWL, guys. Backs against the far back of the cubby. There is a little cubby to the east of here. You can drag that boss. Arrhenius group, make sure you're careful over there because we should probably all be back here for now. Deal, you're in the group 8. You should be over here with the healing the Arrhenius group. Coincidence, also over here. Don't pull the boss. Alright, Thorin, um, when Hydro gives the okay, you're, I'm gonna actually have you start the boss fight, just so that I actually take X off of my person so people don't get confused. Um, just so that you get that aggro real quick. Okay.
Okay, the Solnius group can come out over here and get all set up and ready. Don't start the event, though. Alright, is the uh, Arrhenius group ready? In position. Yeah, should be. Started it. Yeah. Is that safe to be in the Arrhenius group or can I go to the boss? Oh, you guys... I'm sleeping. Oh, I'm sleeping. You'll worry. Is that what was that question? Do I need to be with Iridus, or can I come back? No, you can come back to the main group. Alright. Jordan, just keep uh, main tanking. Yep. If you need to pop out, Thorn will definitely be your... People are to hop in DPS. Your coincidence. Guys, please watch your threat. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> If you have threat, please try to drop it. We need Jordan to make sure that he's top threat. Everyone else, we're going to be moving low and You're slow until Jordan has enough. Tap in yourself if you if you do DPS right now. Beautiful. We got Jordan, Human Shield, and Thorn Maul. Numbers one, two, and three. Arrhenius healers, when you fall asleep, if you can fall out. Oh, no. Alright, he's gonna be going to sleep. No, we don't want to use poison. Poison here. Reposition, Mithrin. Yeah, I'm Once sleeping. you're awake. Alright, he's going to sleep. Big ads first, ladies and gentlemen. Get her. Casters on skull, melee on X. Fire oh, two workings. All right. Well, loose. Go first, and then we'll um, split off to melee on X, casters on square. Dragon is loose. Everyone, remember, ads need to go down first. Let's try to make sure that we're pulling any ads off our boss. Excuse me, our tanks. Remember, healers, it's a long fight. Mana potions tease early. Is there any chance we could bring these ads like to the back of the boss so they're not run fine? Yeah, we had we oh, had our, our tanks were asleep. Alright, are all of the ads down? Yes. Beautiful. Alright everyone, we're just going to be blasting him away for the rest of the bar. If you are yeah, low I... on health, Pete, please feel free to step out. Drink a mana pot. Do you need heals Band-Aid. over there? Sorry, were you talking to me? Do you need extra heals over there? Uh, I think we're okay. Curious. 
Human shield, uh, just give me the heads up when you wanna switch out. I mean, bubble you. over here, um, anyone? Grog, can I get you to, to go over there? Can I get a bubble on human shield, please? I'm on my way. I think once you okay. kill Salmius, though, the other one he spawns, so. Yeah. Is Sally, can I get a bubble? Put, uh, do you need formal to run over and innovate you, Hydra? Uh, yeah, I can use an innovate for sure. He's I can't right, right now, I just took over tank. Yeah. Okay, guys. Okay. <laughs> We're super close, ladies and gents. We're fine over in the small dragon group. Seven percent. I drew a slip. When the boss dies, step away from the chest. No one will touch it. Yes, I'll link everything in there and we'll roll accordingly. Booyah! Very nice. He's still up? Okay. He's friendly. Nicely done, nicely done. Alright, ladies and gents, let me just check really quickly the ads to make sure that... I'm just showing everyone what's in the chest real quick. Okay, dope. Just wanna make sure that we don't uh, have any Make sure you loot all the Synchrom Dreamer spawns and ads because they're about to disappear. I know, I know, I know. Cool. Some of them are on top. He's on top of, though. That's the problem. Alrighty, so I'm gonna be looting. Excuse me. I'm gonna be um, rolling off the body first, and then we'll do the chest at the end. We have the following items. Along with the head. So, alrighty. Our first item that we're gonna be rolling off is the Jade Stone Helmet. Do we have any SRs for it? Not what I can see. 